Hey guys, so um, I got LASIK. Yeah. My eyes were suction cup to my eyes and got lasers enhanced. So yay! Oh my gosh, guys, LASIK was a godsend. For one thing, I'm in Hilo, Hawaii right now. Oh my gosh, I'm actually in Hawaii. I've been here for seven, well, <laughs> almost for a month technically. I was on a cruise and now it's like staying here. Originally, I was in Oahu. I'm in Hilo. Went through all the islands. Now I'm back in Hilo. <laughs> so yay. I was on New Vision Cruise Lines for about a week. Now I'm here for another week in Hilo. So like, fine. I got Contour, which is basically like an advanced version of LASIK, which is basically like you uh, get your eyes more cu uh, calibrated and like more customized to your fitting, technically, so like know about your cornea. I think I'm not sure what I'm talking about, honestly. I don't know much about eyes. <laughs> I'm not an ophthalmologist, so like, ah. Uh. <laughs> so like right now, uh, it's been two weeks after my LASIK eye surgery. I had I had Contour in both of my eyes to give me 2015 vision, so like, um, I can see a lot better now. This is nice. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. So like, I just had my procedure done about two weeks ago. It went well, actually. Overall, my experience was quite well. <laughs> oh my gosh, the experience, guys. Um, doing LASIK is interesting, I would say the least. Um, in the beginning, I had to get... I had to get consultations, and that's where my contacts were three days, thank god. Well, <laughs> I actually wore my contacts for two days prior to examination, I had to do it again. And, um, I had to fly back in from another state to go there, so I had my procedure done in Texas, by the way. Overall, um, my doctor was nice, actually, I had many doctors, I'll say that, but like, yeah, mm, mm. Yeah. So I had my procedure done in the Austin LASIK Eye Institute in Texas and like overall my experience was nice actually. Um, my doctors were quite well trained I suppose. I hopefully didn't say that because I actually didn't do much uh, research beforehand but so yeah. So like I had to get um, my consultations done for both of my eyes. I apparently I was really nearsighted before, so now uh, during my consultations, I had to get like had to do a lot of testing beforehand. I sorry I didn't get any footage of that. Sorry because I wasn't expecting film honestly, but yeah. Um, after my consultations, I <laughs> went into surgery. So like that was mainly like mostly like a big. You're laying on a table and then you're like stretched. You ha your eyes are dilated quite wide on, with a, like contraption. And it's like this, honestly. Like, oh gosh. If I wasn't Asian, this would good on me. But, oh god, this is hard to close. Oh, there are birds. Ah! Anyway, like, you're trapped to a machine. You can't blink or do anything or move your head. Because, like, then again, that would make you almost go blind. <laughs> Overall, like, it was uncomfortable. But then again, I'm glad it was over. <laughs> Overall, the procedure took, like, about maybe five minutes. Maybe five minutes. If you're quite well, I didn't. Mine took like about 15 mainly because I had a hard time like getting used to it because I was not <laughs> I was not having it honestly to be honest it was very uncomfortable and I did not like it at all but overall I'm happy I did procedure after surgery it lasted like an entire like 15 minutes overall but anyway um everything was quite blurry uncomfortable I'm not gonna lie it was very uncomfortable for the first few days uh, my eyes my eyes were very sensitive to light I'll say that um, <laughs> yeah, I was not having a good day that day. I was giving aspirin, also I took some Xanax, I believe is what I took beforehand. And after surgery, I was giving these two bottles to put uh, in my eyes after surgery. Yeah, I, I can see well, but like, uh, my vision was blurry throughout the day, so I had to sleep it off. I also had to get, take some of these, uh, sterilized eye drops for like every hour or so which was really uncomfortable and like demanding but like then again it was I had surgery I have one pair of eyes so like yeah I kind of had to do it I since I'm in Honolulu, Hawaii I only had like my three-day consultation to uh, my check back consultation and I've been here for almost a month so I need to check back my doctor so like hopefully I get my thing back soon because I I hopefully I'm taking care of these eyes I can see well for the most part so like that's good at least before uh before my like eye surgery I used to wear contacts or glasses so I, like these were my old glasses I wore before honestly I can still see well with these glasses but it's just quite blurry honestly this is bad for my vision honestly but like 
This is what I used to look like before getting my contacts. I can still see clear! What the hell? I'm just not putting these on for a first time. I can see clear, mostly. It's kind of blurry, but... I can read! What the- oh wait, no, that hurts my eyes, actually. <laughs> okay, never mind. That- that- okay, never mind. That- I can- I can read clear for a second and my eyes start hurting. Oh god, that was a bad idea. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, that was my, uh... This is about two, three weeks into having my surgery, and, like, overall, I- I enjoy- I enjoy this, honestly. Like, sir, this LASIK was so far really good. Hopefully it's safe like that, honestly, so... Thanks for like watching my video about uh, my review on the LASIK, so yeah. Ah, that did not work my hair. Well, uh, <laughs> thanks for watching guys, bye. It's gonna be really red, that's normal. All right, let's go ahead and have you stand up if you're ready. Make sure you're feeling all right. All right, so we're gonna take you over to the postdoc room. Dr. Lee will get that final peek. Um, go over any questions again about the drops or whatever, and then home for the nap. Alright? How long should I have that for? Two to four hours. Yeah. Preferably four. Yeah. Alright, man. Thank you. Right, we'll take you on over to see Dr. Lee. Can you give us a phone? Well, that just happened. <laughs> Can you? Okay. Oh, God. And yeah, we don't want you using your phone, by the way, uh, most of the day today. Uh, oh, God. And yeah, we don't want you using your phone, by the way, uh, most of the day today. Uh, Kind of take it easy. Distance will be okay after, you know, TV okay after that, but... And you can follow other leads after. No phone, no computer today. Okay. Slowly. No close up work. Ugh, great. I mean, looking at a monitor that you're holding, trying to avoid that early on after surgery. Okay. So it should be normal for it to be cloudy or mm -hmm. uh, blurry a little bit. Yes. But I can see mostly good now. Yeah, mm -hmm. so it's not going to be, you know... Black anything. It's just blurry right I now. only saw blackness for a majority of the time. A little bit, yes. That kind of scared me. That is normal. This hurts right now. <laughs> I just had eye surgery. Oh, great. Uh, I'm having three layers of sunglasses and a jacket over me to block out the sun. Great. Time to go to bed. Uh, okay, guys, so. Yeah, it hurts right now. It's been about like three hours past. I just woke up. Okay, this hurts right now. Out of the sun, but like I'm supposed to be sleeping more. Just like a Tylenol. It's like two prescription eye drops. It just it just hurts, guys. Ow. But from what I open my eyes, I can actually see a lot better now. But oh, this hurts. <sighs> I just want the next day to happen already. Uh, see you guys later. Hey guys, so right now I'm still recovering. It's been like only about six hours after surgery and my bloods are, my eyes are still a little bit bloodshot. For the most part, that's, that's why I feeling a lot of tingling right there. So yeah, I'm sorry if I can't talk right now. I'm just like, ugh, so I don't care anymore. I just want to get in bed. Oh my gosh, ow. Oh my God, my eyes are bloodshot. <laughs> Better than before, actually, just saying. So hopefully tomorrow's gonna be better. Hopefully it's tomorrow's a better day. <laughs> See you in a bit. Hey guys, so right now, I it's been about two weeks after surgery. Yeah, I... Overall, I can see well. I'm happy right now. I can actually see a lot better than it before. I have not worn glasses for the past two weeks, and so far, yeah, I'm in Honolulu right now, in Hawaii, so... Yeah, I've had a vacation. <laughs> I actually went scuba diving earlier, or snorkeling, whatever it's called. I actually got some water in my eyes, which I wasn't supposed to, because I... <laughs> it's only been, like, like, less than two weeks after surgery, and I'm not supposed to have, like, water in my eyes after, like, for about a month. Not bad so far, honestly. Hey guys, so I'm finally back home. Um, oh my gosh, guys, it's been over six months. I actually had my LASIK eye procedure. Um, overall, my eyes are actually in good shape, to be honest. Well, from what I can tell, I'm supposed to have a three month consultation a long time ago. Didn't happen because of this quarantine. So, um, this is an issue. Overall, hopefully, my eyes are actually in good condition. I'll say that. Um, I would suggest people doing LASIK or Contour if you were actually able to. The reason why I want Contour because 
if you're gonna be spending this much money actually on procedure might as well get the best one and make it last longer honestly so yeah um my eyes i would say they're worth it honestly i can see a lot further than i did before i was nearsighted i didn't know if i said that before but i'm very nearsighted and i cannot see you for the life of me but now i can actually see a lot of things up close now and Without any help, I can actually, like, read a lot better and, like, actually, like, see more things and more vibrant things, which I love. <laughs> oh my gosh, like, I can't believe I gone without life would actually, like, seeing, like, these, this type of things without any, uh, like, glasses or anything. Like, this is nice. So, yeah, guys, um, if you're claustrophobic or, like, scared of people touching your eyes, which is bound to happen regardless anyway... Post-op recovery wasn't too much of an issue, um, the only thing you had to do was just basically put eye drops and, like, put a lot of, like, antibiotics into your eyes every so often. It wasn't, for the trade-off, for a better eyesight, it's not too bad, honestly, but, like, and again, I'm really happy with my eyes, and oh my gosh, this lighting makes my eyes look more better and pretty. <laughs> I have really dark girl eyes, so, like, I'm really happy I can see it right now. 